what is honor at its most essential distilled level. If you had to give it a definition, what is that unique for you at this time? The only focus is being true to yourself. There's no scale to it. Am I going to choose me or am I going to choose the whole? Now imagine you're watching a movie and you're the hero in the movie. What would you want to cheer for you doing? You would cheer for you, quit that job, do this, whatever. You would, you would cheer. You would want to see the hero in that movie go with honor, act with honor. So if you're not sure what to do, do what you would do if you were in the movie and you were the hero. What would you want you to do? The honorable path will take you places that you do not expect. It will not meet the pictures that you have or want from life. But if you take the path of honor, you'll discover it, and it'll be a cool adventure. Against all better intellectual knowledge, which then poses itself as fear, we have to kind of just jump over that barrier sometimes, somehow evoking a great sense of courage. And there's many ways to evoke this, but one is just to do it. Here's the game, the game of life. How do you want to play? Why do you do it? You do it because you're fed up with the way it has been. Or you're fed up with this intuitive sense like, fuck, I'm playing it small, or I'm, I'm playing into fears, and I'm distracting my true life's purpose, and I'm detrimenting people instead of benefiting people. But now, a different force is activated. It's the will, it's the willingness, it's that courage. The thing is, you're born nothing, and you are nothing, and then rather be responsible for being nothing that I can choose any action right now, and any path right now, I could choose from honor now, and now, and now, you could.